Hey guys, welcome. Welcome to today's topic. Uh, thanks for joining me. Today I'm going to talk about something that is quite integral, important and critical part of uh, running your small business, uh, which is how to accept payments that will make your life, work life, business life, uh, home life much easier without stress, without much overwhelm. And what happens, right, uh, if you are starting a new gig, so you have an idea, you get excited, you jump into this uh, online bandwagon and all of a sudden you are faced with all sorts of different setbacks, challenges, roadblocks coming at you from all different angles. And what I mean by that is like, for example, how to create that captivating website or how to start building your online presence uh, on social media sites, how to create that social media ecosystem that gets you noticed, that gets you liked, that makes you the trusted advisor, trusted consultant for your own target audience. Or it could be that how to create that first information product or service uh, that you need to start uh, reaching out to your customers towards to, right? Uh, or it could be even that how to create uh, that irresistible enticing offer that will uh, allow your customers to raise their hands and they say, yes, hey, I really want to buy your service. I really want to, I, I really like what you are talking about and how do I become part of your own ecosystem? Or it could be that uh, as simple as payments, we think accepting payments uh, is like a no brainer. But when you add all these things, right, all these different pieces of puzzles, everything is kind of become like a moving part. Now, when you add in accepting the payments, right, that becomes that adds to your worries. Uh, and I'm going to I'm going to get rid of I'm going to mitigate those overwhelm that uh, worries for you today. So I heard about this company called Stripe. Uh, I did not really get a chance to wrap my arms around that uh, until now because I was kind of going in all different directions. Uh, so until now I had relied on accepting like primarily uh, checks uh, with the businesses that I uh, I am doing my business with, right? Uh, COVID-19 gave me this great chance, great opportunity to kind of reset, rethink. Uh, and one of the things that I focused on is how to accept payments uh, through this system. So before I get into that, right, let me talk about Stripe, right? As I started studying them a little bit, right? So Stripe has become what is called internet middleman. So much so that 50% of all internet transactions, they are processed through Stripe. So I thought Pay PayPal had its own place because we readily use PayPal throughout for any transactions, right? But Stripe has immensely grown into popularity. They closed their books last year with 35 billion, B with a boy, 35 billion plus uh, revenues. And it has become like a go-to system for small business owners. It was co-founded by two brothers from Ireland, John and Patrick Collison. And uh, they started their journey right when they're in the school. They dropped out of the school and then they had some great ideas uh, in the e-commerce apps and how to make business owners life easier. And they started, uh, they founded a couple of companies that became quite a hit and then that sort of transpired them to start thinking about how to make business owners life easier and that is what Stripe is is in a nutshell, right? So you can think about PayPal, Square, Apple Pay, Authorize.net. These are all ways for you to accept payments. Uh, Stripe also fits into the same umbrella. It's uh, transaction fees are quite uh, compatible with PayPal. They charge 2.9% uh, uh, with a 30 cents uh, transaction fee. So in a sense, what happens, right? Uh, it, it is like a framework that allows you to set up your invoices, billing, your customers. Uh, you can create recurring payments. Uh, 
you can also send uh, emails so everything customize emails to your customer so it's a it's a great tool i have fallen in love with it and now i know why 50% of the internet transactions why the small business owners are hooked on to that right uh, so in a nutshell right what i have done here i have i'm laying out certain key capabilities uh, I, i'll hit on that very quickly account signing is very very simple uh, it's very less invasive all you need to do is basically add your name business account information business name details bank account information so once you create an account every time when you start logging in next time you will have to create what is called two step authentication uh, you have you have to give them uh, your sms number and then it becomes like uh, your one time password so when you log in to a user id password they will send you sms uh, that becomes your one time password and then you are in right so once you are in you can then create start creating customers customer creation process is also very breeze uh, not a, not a lot of hassles all you need is their name address phone number their credit card details uh, it also has great uh, templates to brand your business so you your business may have certain logo icons uh, if if you are following certain themes on your website uh, social media in terms of the branding themes in terms of the color notation and what not you can try to bring in those color themes as a part of uh, uh, delivering that unifying uh, richer experience to your cu- customers uh, now there is also what is called email management feature so if you want to send uh, emails to your customers uh, there are two ways you can do that uh, th- those emails can get sent directly through the stripe or through your uh through your own uh, business name but if you want to do that right what you need to do you uh, uh, st- i have actually mentioned that in in in, in my tutorial you will have to kind of uh, enter the dns records dns records is something if you go log into your hosting provider such as uh, amazon web services or bluehost or godaddy whatever uh, hosting service or provider that you may be u- using there is this feature of dns management and there are about 7 or 8 uh, records cms records that you will have to input it takes about 48 hours to 72 hours for uh, that handshake to get verified and then you can then start sending those emails from your own business to your customers so, so that's one feature that is there in my video tutorial as well then the other feature great feature is that you can start creating coupons or discounted offers so think about this right uh, there is a thanksgiving holiday memorial day weekend or christmas or black friday sale you may have some ideas to come up with some 50% off 25 25% off whatever the offers that you might be thinking about right you can actually create those discounts and embed that into your ongoing offers you can also uh create like invoice templates and billing templates uh, gears towards uh, towards your own business so that's that's another great feature you can also set up recurring payments and that is something i have found extremely useful which is basically rather than looking into a calendar in terms of when uh, when to uh, when to uh, uh receive that payment so for example some of your bus- uh, business owners customers they can they'll be starting uh, services on 10th of uh, particular month or some business owner may join you on 25th of particular month right so running from month to month that can become like quite a chore uh, the beauty of this is that you can actually set up a recurring uh, payment system where you can actually create certain products and and by products i mean like website services that could be one product search engine optimization that becomes your another product social media management that becomes your another product so all these products uh, you can make it associate with your recurring payment that is called the subscription model and that is going to make your life job quite easier and i think that's pretty much it in a nutshell 
not a fancy it's, a, it's extremely simple to use i would highly recommend it if you get stuck feel free to revert back and i'm putting together my link below for my video and i'm also inviting you to join my facebook group uh, there's also a link below to set up an appointment appointment with me so if you want to get started with uh, your business uh, whether it is a website whether it is social media management whether it is uh, building your personal brand whatever challenges that you might be facing uh, i'm going to give you the link below feel free to book an appointment with me i would love to see where you are coming from and how i can be of that help to you to make your life easier during this covid-19 um, uh, pandemic so signing off wishing you all the best talk to you soon